Okay guys, it's Dark Whip here again. It's going to be a bit happier video for Star Trek Fleet Command. Today I am um, sort of going to mainly forget about what the last couple of videos have been about and let's focus on the Franklin A getting it to tier 8 and what it's going to cost me to get it. Well, I won't get it to tier 9 unless I get to level 47 um, because I can't get it any further than that. But what it's going to cost me to upgrade the three weapons and the um, defense and all that sort of stuff. And see what it can, how well it does now, and what crew I'm using um, now for, that I have been given, suggested by um, one of my watchers. Um, I sort of didn't go detail deep into it last time on the last video, but let's go a little bit deeper. So yes, it's a bit happier video today. Let's end the weekend with a happier video. For, well, it's the end of the weekend for me, because it's Sunday for me. Okay, so let's go out of here and go through a couple of screenshots we've got here. So, okay, so we'll scroll along. Okay, so that I'll show you what that is lately today. And yes, the clock has stopped working again, but we're not going to talk about that. It's I'm just over-talking about it. Um, okay, so this is me trying to hit a level 49. I gave it a go. And I didn't succeed. So I cannot kill a level 49. Only just cannot kill it. At the moment. Okay. So and then I went up and had a look at what the power level of a level 50 is. So it's a, it's quite a lot. I didn't bother trying to kill it. I just wanted to have a look at what strength it was. So now let's go to the game itself. Okay. So we'll scroll back through. So, before I try to kill the level 48, just to see if I could do and what I could do there, I was able to kill, in this one, okay, so scroll a bit here, okay. So, I can kill level 47s from to here, just click on here for a second, it's a bit sort of, as you know, sometimes I can kill... So I can kill nine, no problems now. Again, a nine again. And again, nine again. That's why I went... Okay, let's see if we can kill 48s. So on the third 48, I can kill. So basically I can kill three 48s. The reason I got four on this one was because one of them was the finishing off of the this one. That I didn't finish there. So almost killing a four of them on a run, a 48. Um, so then as you can see, this is killing the 49. I did have two goes, as in a sense that I went and tried it twice, just in case I did perform a little bit better on the second time. So then I went and killed the almost finished ones to finish off them because I were no he did must have score the points for finishing them off so then I went and killed some 49s it's sort of 47s but that was while I still had killed those so we won't sort of count that once so let's now go and have a look at the ship Something funny going on, but that's <laughs> um, a glitch, which happens very often in the game. Okay, so what I'd need to upgrade the weapons now is 1.8 million. So we'll see if we click on it. At exactly 1.8 1. 1 million MK2s I need to do it. That's going to take a lot of grinding. A lot. Especially since you can't get a pack even if you wanted to. Um, if it does come available, I will make a video showing you what you get in the pack when you're level tier 8 ship, what the pack is they offer. But, yeah, we'll see what happens. They have removed it from the store, and we'll see. It did pop up there, if I noticed, the other day. Um, so 1.8, but I'd already hadn't upgraded my ship to tier 8 at that time. So all the weapons... Uh, the same but I did notice this 
epic and refines crystal. I went, uh oh. But lucky I've got a few of those. Um, and then we come over to the shield, and it also requires epic refined crystal. Actually, it also requires more, doesn't it? The weapon requires 73, 73, and 73. So the shield actually requires less, so that's not too bad. And it also requires less. 1.2 million Mark II, MK2s to... Um, do that so I'd probably do that first and as you can see I do not have this I cannot do this <laughs> until I get to level 47 and I'm only at level 48 a six at the moment and yes even the cargo bay requires epic mark 4 parts and it requires I could do that if I wanted to but there would be no need to it would just bring up the cost of repairing the ship so I will not be doing that um, one <laughs> that's always the last thing I do okay so as we can see I will we'll go for the, the what now you gotta to remember too I have been doing a lot of the upgrades for um, the research so it may make a bit of difference here but we'll see what it looks like anyway at my level, at my research levels, this is what the ship is at at the moment. We'll go through the crew once I finish this. So I can scroll up, you would have had time to have a look. And so defence. And this is with the crew that I have on there at the moment. Again, I will show you that at the moment. Now when it comes to warp, remember I do have the warp extra research done. And even with warp speed, what do we look at? Warp speed 22. It's actually quite slow. But I think my, um, Kelvin is a, like warp 33 or something. Or was it jellyfish? Oh, we'll go through them while we're here anyway. And have a look at the warp speeds are on those. I might do that right now. Just so we can have a look at that. Because I've done some warp research. Okay, so the Kelvin, I think I'm on the Kelvin. Yep, Kelvin is a warp 28.8. And the jellyfish is a warp 37.7. So I knew that, that was, I must have done some more research that's boosted up even more. So warp speed on the jellyfish is the highest at the moment. We'll just have a look at the Enterprise just to compare it. So it's saying... The Enterprise, we we'll click on that to log it properly, is a 31.4. A warp range of 95. Again, remember that's with my research. And the Auger, we'll confirm that one. Because it's not tier, at maximum tier yet, it's only warp is 23.5. So, yeah, and what. We we'll might have a look at the D4 while we're here. At the moment, it is 24 as well, warp 80. So, yes, there is a bit of a difference between them all. And that's with the... We've got to come to here. We want to have a look at this. Okay, so now we confirm... Oops, yep, so now we want to have a look at the crew that I'm using. So this is a crew that I have are using at the moment. Um, and it works very well for me. Okay. So, I also want to go back to... I'm still working on the levelling it up, but it is quite expensive at this level. So, it's going to cost me 60k. That's a lot to get the next XP on it, which will take about 38. So, I've got about three more levels I can do to it for sure. I'm not sure if it's going to go to four over 40, it doesn't really tell you that at any stage, does it? Until you actually get there. But what does it require? If I take him on. 45. And it that's its maximum. So my guess is it's 
probably not going to let me get to foot level 45 until at least get to the next tier level. Um, okay, so let's send it here to here, and it will have a little play around. So, obviously, at the moment, if you want, you can probably... Come on, come on, come on. Okay, but you may want to go any further because I've already given you most of the information, but let's have a little fly around if you want to stay watching um, and see it actually in action. Now, I did do an XP level in between those two 48s and it didn't help. So, at the moment, I can't see the need to waste, was it something like 60k a latinum? And it probably won't make any difference. <laughs> It might make a difference here. We'll go through the logs as I do hit these ones. Okay, so we'll hit this one. That's the closest one. And that'll give the shields time to regen as between each one. We can go through the logs. And see how many um, rounds it takes get it done okay so as you can see wasn't all that much damage done to the ship the shields got took a fair bit of a beating okay so we'll have a look here okay so the rounds it took five rounds now I have thought I had done it in less rounds than that so for the first one it took seven rounds and I'll scroll a bit slow because if someone wants to skip through this, they can always fasten the video up. But I know some people love reading logs. So with the research that I have done at this present time, this is where I'm at. Some of the research I've noticed when it comes to the um, away missions research tree it's um, it's up to epic so you, and I'm not winning any epic at the moment um, so I don't know I have to start doing a lot of and concentrating on a lot of the epic ones that give you the epic um, research tokens because that's where I'm at at the moment I need to do a a lot of epic research to be able to do that. Okay, come on, come on, come on, this is taking forever. I don't think we'll scroll through all of them this way, but we will come in and just see if, it, if the rounds are any different. Okay, so that's it. So now, all right. So let's be happy, happy, happy. I should have some happy, happy music on, because <laughs> at least I am killing one ship more than I was before. Only because I upgraded two weapons and put some XP on it am I able to do that much a little bit better. Okay, we'll just look at this one and see how many rounds it took. Five rounds again. So it must be, I thought I got it down to that beforehand. I thought it must be, must be another ship I'm thinking of where I've seen three rounds. Forgot to check how many rounds that one took, but we'll do that in between this one. 
my feeling it might have been quicker on the last one because the shield is... Okay, so have a look at this one. Five rounds. So it looks like it's constantly five rounds now. Four. I mean, so four rounds on that one. So for some reason, that one got it done a little bit better. I don't normally like doing these sort of videos because it's boring to watch someone else just kill ships. <laughs> okay, so that one actually took a look. I've got a feeling this one's going to be five rounds. Five rounds. Just looking at the damage of the shields is what I was going by then. Um, with this one... Okay, so... Look at that one. Five rounds again. So I reckon I could possibly say it is taking five rounds with sometimes maybe getting it in four. But by the time I get this XP up, I might be able to get one more ship in. You'd want to hope, after doing all that, and doing a little bit more research, I've still got a bit more research to do in um, the away team research tree, so, and maybe I might get lucky and get some epic when I do the next um, set of missions, which is during about four hours, I've got to get them finished. Let's have a quick... Oh, I want this one. Have a quick look in here. No, the away team. So, I've got one's going to finish in four hours. I am not don't have enough speed-ups to get that one done. And as you can see, the clock's working, not working. So, oh, I've got one eight-hour. And a few... 15 minutes. No, that's only... I've got eight hours worth of one hours. Eight times one hour. Um, I will show you something else that people asked. In others, scroll, 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 scroll. One point, uh, 1,250 refresh tokens for it. I haven't bothered using them because there's no use to use them if the clock's not working. That's the way I see it. And if you haven't got speed ups, why use it? Okay, so I wonder if I got 10 that one because we got so close. Have a look at this for a second. This one we got. Five rounds. Yep, we got ten this one. So we got the ten. Oh, that one got it in four. That might have made the difference. And what about the number uh, ten? Five. There's a couple that I got it done in four rounds. And may have been some of the research I got done since I had finished the last one. So we'll just die and we'll probably call that it for the day so that's where i'm at at the moment my ship is at the moment and you can see the cost it's going to take now that's going to take a lot to get each weapon and each, and the shields done or defense whatever whatever the defense was i can't remember what they call the defense on this one that's it's always hard to work out because it all depends on what happens because research I mean repair I should say you got the this one here yeah, I can, if I can get another 700 here that's another 15k 
But when you're talking needing another 600k, that 15k doesn't seem to think, it doesn't feel like it's going to make much of a dent. But while we're here, we'll collect this. As you can see, I get about 36. Okay, so that's where I'm up to. So what we might do is come here and we'll click on this and we'll say thank you for subscribing. And I hope this one's a bit more cheered up video compared to my last couple. But, um, yeah. Let's keep hoping it's going to get any better. Maybe Arc 2 is going to be better. Let's only hope. And how much longer can we Arc 2? So what's it, 23rd today? So we've got, when, when do I think most likely it will be? It will most hopefully we can only dream that we've only got just over a week and maybe we get arc two or do we have to wait three weeks to get arc two who knows they don't like giving us a date of when it's going to actually happen i've got a bad feeling going at the calendar there i'm looking at the calendar sorry um next month i've got a bad feeling you ended up being on the eighth not the first. It'd be great if it did on the first. It's just your time, which is a second on mine. And then be, oh, I get a feeling it's going to be the ninth, so we'll have to go for another week. We can only hope that Arc 2 comes around. It's going to be so much better than Arc 1 of Next Generation. But let's see how we go. And yeah. Thank you for watching. This is Starquip signing out. Thank you again.